All new at five, the Department of Veterans Affairs is working hard to resolve a big backlog in vets disability claims. It's a backlog according to testimony on Capitol Hill this week that could take up to two years to clear. Mike Gooding tells us the department vows to do everything it can to close these cases as quickly as possible. You know, we want to serve these men and women as well as they have served us, and, and that's our goal each and every day. According to data from the Department of Veterans Affairs, there are now more than 829,000 disability claims on record in its overall inventory as of today. More than 227,000 of them are over 125 days old and considered by the VA to be in backlog status. The increase in filings was triggered in part by the passage of the 2022 Honoring Our Pact Act that expanded toxic exposure benefits and the nearly 600,000 new Pact Act claims that were filed. Uh, the team here at VA understands this challenge and uh, we're taking a head on because it is our goal and our promise to get you those benefits as swiftly as possible. VA Press Secretary Terrence Hayes says resolving the claims and getting the numbers down to zero is a top priority and over 8,000 cases per day are being processed. Uh, the president and Secretary McDonough has charged us with ensuring that we swiftly deliver benefits to veterans and survivors who, who deserve it, who earned this. And, uh, and we're doing everything that we can uh, from hiring an additional 3,100 plus uh, claims adjusters to additional folks within our healthcare system. Mike Gooding, 13 News Now. The Hampton VA Medical Center is planning a PACT Act Fair June 24th to help local veterans by providing PACT Act toxic screenings, benefits information, and assisting with enrollment.